You're watching the one and only ABC 3340, the station working for you. May, of course, right around the corner. And in the month of May, 80,000 people are projected to come to Chakalaka Park in Oxford. And the number of sporting events at the park has increased each year since it opened in 2017. ABC 3340's Aaron Wise joins us from Oxford. Aaron, the city recently secured two new contracts for the park. Brenda, one of those contracts is to be the host of a women's professional fast pitch team called the Vipers. There's actually a draft watch party that's going to be going on here tonight at Chakalaka Park for that team. The other contract was to be the host for another collegiate tournament that's going to be taking place in May. Now that's one of over a half dozen tournaments that's going to be going on next month here, drawing in thousands of people, not only to the park, but to local businesses like like hotels, restaurants, and stores. Hundreds of sports teams visit Oxford's Chakalaka Park each year. When there's four and five hour breaks in between games, they're not staying here. They're leaving and going to find other things to do. Businesses like Texas Roadhouse are preparing for 126 teams for high school and collegiate baseball and softball tournaments at the park next month. Um, we are making sure that we are staffed up both in our kitchen as well as in our front of house um, and that we are just really welcoming and accommodating to especially the baseball teams. We know that they're larger parties. We know that a lot of times they are time sensitive. The city continues to add to the lineup at Chakalaka Park. That growth is a positive for businesses. It's a huge community partnership of revenue. You know, in the future 10 years, what do you see Chakalaka Park being in the area around it? So as you noticed when you were coming in, we've got bridge construction going on right outside the park. So that bridge is, uh, is, is going to be four lanes and that will be complete in June. We will then bid out the road project uh, June or July, construction to start in September for uh, Leon Smith Parkway to be widened to five lanes all the way down to Friendship Road. Uh, we have um, signed contracts for development deals across the street from Chocolaka Park with hotels and uh, retail. The park itself is growing too. Additional seating will bring the softball field's capacity to 1,500 this year. New locker rooms connected to the dugouts were also built. We're constantly looking every year, what can we add to increase capacity? What can we do to make our park, you know, the number one priority for everyone that wants to play anywhere to come here? Now, the city is working on an official economic impact study with Alabama Power. They expect to have some of that data back by the end of this summer. For now, reporting live in Oxford, Aaron Wise, ABC 3340 News.